Hey guys, it's Falky, Anthony Constant. Let's do a quick woohoo. He's not going to do it, he's playing with his wand. Oh, I flipped on my beak. Alright, we'll do back beak instead. Um, today's video is about the future. What's going on? Everybody's complaining about this, that, and the other, about the present, and forgetting that the game's only just started. So, what was it? We're two weeks into it. Just heard news that someone in Singapore's already reached level 40, and that's in less than two weeks, which is good because they're paying the wages, and the rest of us can play the game. Um, but come on, back week. But just thinking, looking around, and what do we know could be coming? Because at the moment, we know that this isn't going to be the full game. There's other types of events to come. And just doing a quick Google search and looking around, we get to see a glimpse of what may be coming ahead. Um, for example, we when we look at our um, vault in our um, utilities, there's gaps. We've got the three at the top: scrolls, restricted books, silver keys. We've got a gap there, and then dark detectors. We know things are going to be happening. We know from one of the two of the first um, data mines. Um, that happened that there's actually things in the code that we haven't seen yet there's a few potions when we look at the um, some of the master um, charts there's potions there that we haven't seen so we're just going to have a, a little look at some of those things in this episode um, and then you can chat down below what you think what might be coming if, or if there's anything else that you know that I haven't seen yet um, so we'll um, start off with the potions, I've started off with the potions, so we may as well talk about the potions. Um, then another, what was it, what did I count? I counted five, six, seven, eight, nine potions that I saw um, on different, different areas. Um, Wizards Hub's got a few of them, as you can see here. These ones are all... The main ingredient is fairy rings, three fairy rings. So we don't know how we get the fairy rings. So is it some kind of event that we've got coming on as a reward or something that we've got to find? Um, but the thing about the fairy rings is the actual length of times um, that these brews actually take. Um, let's see. There's a, Fairy rings, you have um, a vault cap of 1000. So, this, this is probably some spoilers that we're going to get ahead from. But, these this information is in some of the sites that we look at. This is which one's this one? This one's Wizards Unite Hub, and some of the other information is from Jib Entertainment. So, this is information that is out there on, on some of these sites that we always look at. So, it's not as though I'm just putting them at me ass. Um it is information that's there and probably come, some of the information has come from the data mines so let's say these wings um, they are the ingredients in these five potions Felix Felicious Bountiful Beau Memory Potion Draft of Perception and Scintillation so they're all facial things or beautification things um, and looking further into them um, the Felix Felicius is a 30 second brew so that's a very quick brew and it goes all the way up to 2 minutes 50 for the scintillation brew so there's about 20 25 seconds between each brew and they go level up and I think in the order it's Felix Felicius draft of deception then there's memory at 215 bountiful brew at 230 and scintillation potion at 250 so there is a, um, a bit of a gap of a minute, so I don't, we don't know if there's going to be other ones in there, but these are the ones that are actually on Wizards Unite Hub and in the code, I assume. Um, 
What other potions? Um, there's something called a wide eye potion. There's no information about it. We just know it exists. Um, there's one called maybe stay and sure stay. So these are probably like your dawdle drafts. Something called stay might and almost definitely stay. So they've got that kind of connotation to them. That's what we think they do. We don't know. It's in the code. It's going to come up. And then the other potion that's in the code, for those that are familiar with Pokemon Go, there's a, an incense type. It's called Tonic for Trace Detection. And that'll just lure um, traces to your area. So that is in the code as well. Again, um, probably on the master sheets, I think it might have it. Um, it, I haven't looked for the how long it takes to brew, but that is in the game code. So there's a lot more brewing to do there. Um, of course, we'll be getting another cauldron or a separate area to do some of this stuff in. Is another thing because at the moment you've got the main one and then you've got the the pay for one. Um, yeah, so hopefully if we get a chance to get another one if we've got to make these, but then they're, they're, they're pretty quick to make anyway. So um, the ones that we know of. Um, what else do we know that in the future we still have all the mist, rest of the mystery? We've only got. Um, three parts to the mystery out at the moment. Um, that's going to be a long saga, I assume. So that's going to be um, dragged out at some point. Um, again, yeah, we've got glimpses of that in the SOS task force. So I'm not sure if there's going to be some kind of tie-in with that. Um, there's always that. And then, um, at the moment, the other thing that was in the code um, is flu powder. Come to that in a second, just have a cup of coffee. So, flu powder. We don't know too much about this, but then what we do know, it's something to do with team um, battles um, around fortresses so in the code it says there's a team on team Hermione and a team Harry um, it's not one continuous battle though looking at it it's evolved around a duration or an event so it's a, a team play thing um, I don't know if it's going to be a standalone like Team Ron, Hermione or Harry or is it going to be by house? It could be something that, um, if it is by house, it, it kind of makes sense. Um, again, because there's no actual PvP battle in the moment, all you're doing is fighting the fortress and the oddities. Um, could this be the first time of fighting someone else I don't think it's going to come out that soon PvP I think we still got six months to a year that could be a next American summer thing that gives everyone a chance to power up and actually get used to um, our fighting system that we've got at the moment oh, is that, does that mean that's gone off god yeah has that gone off Oh yeah. So I'll stop this screen. Okay. Oh, that's annoying, isn't it? Gee. Come on. There you go. That went off and then I'll come back on again. Um did I I don't think I did, did I? What did I do? Oh yeah. yeah. Ch -ch -ch -ch. Fortresses in the flu network, yeah. This is on um This is the one from Jibs Entertainment. It does say that there's um spoilers. Um, this is the quick summary would be that Wizards and Wizards have um, been using the flu network uh, it allows people to travel da -da 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 -da. so it goes on it's a, to create some sense of team feature uh, of course 
no one knows exactly. It's just in there. Team Harry, Team Ron, Team Hermione. Um, and it, as I said, it's we're in it's um, a, a period of time. Um, so we don't know too much, but it's something that's going to be in the game. We don't know if it's going to be in the game, of course. They could change it all. But there are things to change um, happening. Um, what else is going to happen? As we, as we said in the game, there's loads of um, little loose ends. We know now that we've seen how the other event worked, how that's going to be um, worked into things. So we'll have to see. I'm assuming we can go for each of the families and actually have a small event with that. Um, okay, with the, the better information. Yeah, so we've got that as well to look forward to. And of course, we don't know if these butterfly fairy wings, we have to actually catch them and be sinister and pull these wings off ourselves. So that could be an event like... Um, Getting these um, buck beaks and unicorns, we might have to go around catching these, making the, the potions to make something beautiful, and that could be it. We don't know. We don't know. We don't know. But it's kind of exciting that we know that there are things in the code, and there are other things planned, and hopefully as new updates come out, more little tidbits will um, come out and we can see them in the future. Okay, so that's this little episode. If you like it, subscribe. Hit the like. Oh no, I've never mentioned it before, but there's that little bell as well. Um, so yeah, hit that. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Don't you? Bye.